Hi there, my name is Jamie Hope and I get asked a lot of questions by customers and an interesting one that I got answered, I got asked recently that I'd like to answer is I have MTHFR specifically, I have A1298C, but I also have high folate blood test. What does that mean? Can I take methylfolate or not? So the question that I want to ask if you have high blood levels of folate is what kind of blood test did you get? Did you get blood serum level folate or did you get RBC folate? Because there's a difference. One is basically the amount of folate that's getting into your red blood cells. And if it's getting into a red blood cell, then that means it's usable form, right? So that's the form we care about. If you have high blood serum level folate, you might just be having uh, fortified folic acid. You might be taking a multivitamin that has folic acid in it. You might be eating a lot of dietary folate um, that you can't convert and it's not actually getting into your cells, but you have a lot of it running around in your bloodstream and it may not actually be the right form that you can use. So what I want to ask you is check look and see what kind of test did I have? Did I have an RBC folate test or did I just have blood serum folate? And if you have a choice to ask your doctor to measure this for you, ask them to measure RBC folate. A big difference for you on this will be which test results you get. If you have high blood serum folate, it might mean that you need to reduce folic acid intake I would say if you have MTHFR, try to eradicate it entirely, right? No folic acid in terms of dietary supplement in any vitamins. Try to stay away from fortified foods, right? And then just take your methylfolate supplement. I hope that helps.